through the walkaround in the new Macro Recorder version 4. Existing user will be familiar with the software because the user interface is almost the same. But of course, we have a lot of the improvements. For example, you now have line numbers for the macro. You can toggle the action overlays on and off. And there's a new variable explorer, which you can find here. Let's keep this open for a moment. Then you can pin the program window to stay on top. The many new macro actions. For example, you can now generate images with AI. Just describe what you want the AI to create. Let's save this to a variable. Okay, that's the first action. And then there are other new macro functions. For example, to process images with AI. For example, why not ask the AI what it finds in the image it just created? So instead of capturing uh, the desktop or to load an image from a file, we use the variable with a pick, which has been generated by the AI in the action we just created. And we output the reply of AI in this variable. And then we output it in a message box. Right click and select answer. By the way, we can also save the image. Following the generate image, we have a new macro function, save variable to file. Now we select the variable, which is a picture, and you can either save it to the clipboard or to a file. Okay, let's launch this. First of all, OpenAI creates the image, then it saves the picture onto the desktop, and you can see in the variable explorer the contents of the variable pick. And now we send the picture back to AI and ask what it sees in the picture. And here's the reply of AI. Okay. You can see a preview of the picture here. Now we can open the picture as it has been saved into the, onto the desktop. Awesome. Macro Recorder can now also wait for a change on the desktop or any area. You can set breakpoints for debugging purposes. Then you have the option to play back under the breakpoints or to ignore breakpoints. The repeat action now allows to repeat until a specific time, which you can configure here. The message box can now be customized. Here you can select custom and then add multiple buttons as required. And each button can be renamed and it will launch to a different uh, macro section. Macro Recorder version 4 not only supports OpenAI, but also self-hosted options. Olama is an engine which utilizes the graphics processor, and you get access to great language models, such as Llama 3.1 and many more. 